In a moment, I'm going to begin relaxing you step by step. Get settled in, close your eyes down tightly now and see yourself on the 10th floor of a tall building. Standing outside of an elevator, you press a down button, the doors open, you walk on. Doors close behind you and you press a button called visualization room. The elevator now goes from 10 to 9. With each floor, the elevator goes down. With every easy breath you take, you feel more relaxed. Eight, drifting. Seven, relaxing. Six, letting go. Five, calmly. Four, easily. Three, readily. Two, breathe in a deep relaxation. Breathe out any and all anxieties. One, breathe in calmness, confidence, victory, connecting with your higher self. Breathe out any and all negativity. That's fine. You are doing perfectly. Visualization room floor. Walk off the elevator. Have a seat in your big easy chair in your visualization room where everything you see is from your mind's eye and you know that you are the director the producer of your future and you also know your future is created through your imagination and your imagination is a powerful one you think big see yourself now clearly from your mind's eye at the end of the game today players pouring off the bench to congratulate you getting first star having stopped every puck having come up with every save coaches saying great job players saying great job feeling powerful feeling totally confident if you are indeed a powerful and talented starting goalie you are worthy of outrageous success. You are worthy of winning games time after time after time, again and again and again. You are worthy of stealing games. You are worthy. See yourself now in the game today. Before you go on the ice, you are feeling so confident. You stand up, shoulders back chin up smiling breathing in confidence breathing in the energy in the building to connect with your higher self and then when you go on the ice it's like you have a superman cape on and you get to your net and then was the pucks about to be dropped your mind quiets and you are fully aware of where the players are what hands they are and then the puck is now dropped you're fully aware now of what play is developing before it even develops. And then, of course, laser like focused on the puck. Glove save. See that black puck? Go in to your glove. You got to face off now to your left side. And you do a quick check. Head over puck. Staying low and focused. The puck is dropped. It's passed from the left side to the right side where you can see line A is there and you see exactly where his stick blade is. You come across ahead of the play as he one times it. You make that save. You cover the puck up feeling powerful. The puck is dropped again in your zone. Goes back to the right point, across to the left point. You look through traffic so crystal clear and Bufflin standing in front of the net. And as they shoot it from the point, you see the puck, Bufflin tips it. You stay compact. You know exactly where the puck is going by reading those lines off of the puck and you make that save. You control the rebound. In fact, the save is so good a player on the Winnipeg Jets taps you on the pads as well as your own players. Feeling powerful. Blocker save. Stick save. Sending the puck up and over into the stands. Wrap around save. Bufflin is now all alone 
in the slot and you trust yourself and your ability to come up with the save and you do just that. You make the save and control the rebound covering the puck up. You are powerful. Another glove save. Sheffley's coming down on a breakaway. You feel powerful. You already see yourself making the save and you do exactly that. You make the save on the breakaway, controlling the rebound, covering the puck up. Power. Your team is now shorthanded and you make a round of saves. Save after save after save. Again and again and again. Feeling confident, feeling certain the whole time and you end up covering the puck up. And the fans even clap for you. The Winnipeg fans clap for you feeling powerful. Blocker save. Stick save. Setting the puck up and over into the stands. Two on one save. Winnipeg's carrying the puck out of their zone. They get past the far blue line and you're so aware of where their players are, what hands they are, they get to the red line. You're so aware of what play is developing before it even develops. As they get to your blue line, skating over the left side, get to the top of the left circle. You notice line A is on the right side, around just inside the top of the right circle, a little more to the right, and you know exactly where a stick blade is. They pass that, that, that puck across for the one-timer. You come across ahead of the play. He one-times it into your belly. Big save, controlling the rebound, covering the puck up. The players come back and tap you on the pads, feeling powerful. You now see yourself making any and every other save that I've not yet mentioned that you can now imagine, which will lead you towards success in today's game. And you now see yourself making any and every other save that I've not yet mentioned that you've imagined at some point in the past, which will lead you towards success in today's game. And you now see yourself making any and every other save that I've not yet mentioned that you will imagine at some point in the future, which will lead you towards success in today's game. From there, see yourself getting up from your easy chair, walk over to the elevator, press the up button, the doors open, you walk on, doors close behind you, press button number 10. When you do that, the elevator goes from visualization room to floor number one, where the doors open and your future self, number one goalie in the National Hockey League, Vezina Trophy winner, Conn Smythe Trophy winner, Stanley Cup winner, you see your future self standing there and you look your future self in the eyes and you notice how confident you are. You notice how certain you are. You notice how focused and how quiet your mind is. And you ask your future self, what advice do you have for me for today's game and hear what your future self tells you. And then your future self moves to stand beside you to your left, shoulder to shoulder, and the merge with your future self and you now begins. And now with each floor, the elevator goes up with every easy breath you take. You can see the merge more crystal clear in your mind. You can feel it throughout every cell in your body. Floor two, you feel like you can stop every puck. Floor three, you feel like you can come up with every save. Floor four, you are the number one goalie. Floor five, you are the number one goalie. Floor six, you are the number one goalie. Floor seven, you are the number one goalie. Floor eight, you are the number one goalie. Floor nine, Feeling like you can stop every puck, feeling like you can come up with every save. You see the merge with your future self and you fully complete and you can feel the merge fully complete throughout every cell in your body. On the next floor, floor number 10, you will one more time see the image of you at the end of the game 
today. Players pouring off the bench to congratulate you, having stopped every puck, having come up with every save, getting first star, the coaches telling you how great you played, the players telling you how great you played. You will see that image expanding 10,000 times larger in your mind. Floor number 10, see that image expanding 10,000 times larger in your mind. Players pouring off the bench to congratulate you, having stopped every puck, having come up with every save, gotten first star, players telling you how great you played, coaches telling you how great you played. You see that image getting 10,000 times larger in your mind. You feel it with your eyes. Floor number 10. And although you're crystal clear on that image of how the game's going to end up, you no longer need to think about that at all. You can just focus on being in the moment. You know you will bring the powers of your future self into today's game. And your mind will be quiet, aware of where the players are, what hands they are, what play is developing, laser-like focused on the puck, feeling certain feeling powerful floor number 10 the elevator doors open and you open your eyes